If you want to set sail out of Port Canaveral, you've got all of your pre-pandemic options back and more. We'll have all five of our, our brands up and operating. Carnival, Disney, MSC Cruises, and now Norwegian Cruise Line with the Norwegian Escape launching Saturday. The message here is that uh, the future is bright, we're excited, and we're back. But we've still got a pandemic. So we called up Stuart Chiron, a travel specialist known as the cruise guy, who was on a cruise ship as we spoke. So I've actually been on nine cruises uh, since the restart in June. How are the prices? Well, they're gonna find that uh, the prices are reminiscent to what they were in 2019. What about reduced capacity? This is the most extraordinary time to be able to go on a cruise because there's no lines, there's no waiting. There are some big changes though. Meals are often served by crews. Vaccine cards and COVID tests are usually required before boarding, as are masks indoors. And let me tell you, nothing beats the smile uh, that, that you know, the passengers are receiving from the crews. They are just ecstatic to be back at work. And so far, precautions are keeping the industry afloat and travelers back to their long overdue vacations. Anika Hope, West 2 News. The cruise expert we spoke to.